Yo, what's up, sexy Sam Lander squad? Now, here's this video idea is a little bit weird, and and I just I it's been requested every single video I've done, literally every single video I've done for three weeks, and I it just doesn't seem entertaining. But maybe I don't know what entertaining is, and we're gonna try it here. So the idea is, uh, hold on, let me let me buy condo a gem and uh, chrono spend it. The idea is actually hold on again. Let me go book it off with this item. And I will go gel. Um, so here here's the idea. Let me see if where's my tab button. Tab. We take that off. So I cannot open tab anymore. I cannot see the items that the opponent is building. And the idea is basically. Um, do not ever look at what the opponent is building. And instead, I have to try to guess what That's items they idea. built at the end of the game. Um, which means the gameplay itself is just a normal game where I have to be a little bit more cautious than normal because of the fact that I don't know what he's building. Okay, well, I now know he has blue stone. All right. I am feeling kind of okay here. I'm feeling kind of okay. I don't know where he is exactly, but it doesn't really matter because I got the red, dude. Oh, are you dead here? Are you dead here? Are you dead here? I'm going in. Nice. We did kill him there. Um, so he has blue stone. He's probably going tier one transcendence right now, or if he's not going transcendence. Um, the only way for me to know that is when he finishes transcendence, if he gets power spiked or not. Uh, but the only other thing he could be doing than transcendence is going straight to Yotans, which is something that a lot of people have been doing. So those are pretty much his first two options. And I'll know, I'll know what he does eventually. Yeah, I'm assuming you're going to your blue, which means I can be slightly greedy and go for this wave. It's not actually too greedy because I have my three if I need it. I still have shell and I'm not like far behind by any means. All right, let's go back and buy my tier one book. I don't really know, like I said, I don't really feel like this is going to be the most incredible video, but I, I don't know. Maybe people just want to see a different... Actually, wait a second. Hold on. Maybe that's why this video has been recommended so much. Maybe people want to see a different representation of skill. You know, like, the no HUD challenge was skill because I had no idea what my HP was or my cooldowns were, and yet I'm still able to have enough base knowledge of the game to make it work. Maybe it's the same thing here, where Duel is so based around counter building that even when I can't counter build, I know enough about Duel to make the play. Okay, he has Shell. He has Shell. That was very close. He's not doing too much damage yet, which makes me assume that he does not have tier 2 Yotans, because tier 2 Yotans is uh, actually a pretty significant amount of damage. Um, So my guess is he is going Transcendence. He is going Transcendence. He doesn't have it finished yet, which is why his damage wasn't high enough there. Kill me. <clears throat> That's my guess. Obviously, his relic is shell, and his uh, starter item is blue stone. Don't really have to be uh, <laughs> very smart to deduct those two things. All right. Ouch. I really would love red buff. I'm also extremely healthy here, so... Nice. Okay, you missed. I'm going in. Must still not have transcendence finish because his mana is going down low, actually. 
His damage is a little bit significant. It's starting to make me believe that he might actually have gone Jotun's. Based on how fast his mana consumption is. Oh man, I really thought I had it. I thought I had it. Darn. This isn't up yet. I really want it. If I'm wrong though, and he is going transcendence, then this is a death sentence. I'm going to get absolutely slobbered on over here. Oh God. Okay. I think he definitely went transcendence. Holy shit. My dude's numbies are pumping. They're going for blue. That's cool. I'm going to back and well, I'm not going to back, but I'm going to get the wave. You have to go the other direction. So I'm not scared of dying. If you do go this way and you kill me, I, I will change. still come out ahead because you'll miss an entire wave to tower. So it's worth it. Go over here. Grab this. My next item is probably going to be breastplate. Just be super, um, super basic and concise in my build. Because again, you know, I could be in a dangerous spot without even knowing it. So playing safe is just the best way to play this game. This outfit is Grab nice. this and this. Go the three out there. The red buff runs out. Should I pick up blue? I think I'll just wait for red actually. Wait for red again. Because I have Book of Thoth, right? My man is not going anywhere. And I have Book of Thought, and I have, uh, what is this item called? Sands of Time. So I'm chilling. My mana is chilling. I gotta hit this one. Massive damage. He doesn't have defense yet. There's no way. How much damage did that just do? This two did 234 to me. Oh, he is Soul Eater. Oh my God, that makes so much sense. Okay. He is Soul Eater, dude. Duh. Obviously, Bluestone Soul Eater. That's the fucking... That's the cleanest start. All right. That's why his damage was a little bit low. I'm I'm getting it. There's enough hints to where I'm getting it. Red buff is mine again. My one is maxed out, so Oh god. He does have defense now. He definitely has tier two defense. I'm assuming you go soul leader. I'm assuming you probably are gonna go. Actually, I don't know. There's so many good magic defense items in this game. I'm going to have to wait to see the proc of one. Hello. Like, either I'll have to wait to see Pestilence proc on me, or I'll have to wait to see a Bulwark Shield. If it's neither of those, it's almost guaranteed Genji's. Are you in the wall? Ah! Oh no! Oh my god. Okay. He has shell. Keep it in mind, he has shell. I'm actually gonna go the other route and go straight into Divine because I know he has Soul Eater now. So I want to counter build him with Divine. Counter building without even knowing guaranteed what his items are. That's, that's Chad. I am strong. I heard you over here. That's my blue buff. I prob probably not worth alting it <laughs> in hindsight. <laughs> I thought like, you know, uh, alt it, get the XP, right? It's probably not worth it. Alt it again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 
All right, I'm missing all my stuff. I'm going to need that breastplate soon. In fact, I could go a little bit of life steal myself here. That would not be bad. Now, I know I already got these, so there's no point in checking these, but I do want to get the timer down on them. And this, I'll grab. There's nothing up on the map, and I have a little bit of time before red buff spawn, so I can just chill. Grab this now. And second relic, I don't know yet. I would like to go horrific, but I don't know if he's going to go a sprint or if he maybe already bought a sprint. So I want to wait. Horrific would be really nice to grab, though. All right, I'm much tankier than I was. And also, I can do this. Four hundred damage. With Book of Thoth and Divine, that's a bit low. I am strong. Um. You hurt my friend. Oh man, you are so low HP. Nice. Nice. So, uh, fun fact, the actual combo is well, you use your two, but you don't detonate it until after your alt does the damage. And the reason for that is because while your two is on the ground, it lowers pr magical protection by 15% when it's at max rank. So because it's at max rank, my alt hit 15% harder, my one hit 15% harder, everything chunky just a little bit more. All right, let's see. Okay, you definitely did not go another defensive item. I hit for 394, now I'm hitting for 395, and I assume that's just because variance, or maybe I leveled. So... Probably went cooldown, which means I assume your first defensive item was... It's not Genji's, because I didn't see a proc. Is it Shogun's? Your attack speed's not too fast, is it? Can you auto attack me? Oh, you actually do have a decent attack speed. Oh, it is Genji's. It is Genji's. I think. Okay, so his build so far Bluestone, Soul Leader, Genji's going into a Jotun's right now. That's what his build is. I could be completely fucking wrong, but is this for me? I have quite a bit of knowledge of the game, and I feel like that's what it is at the moment. Let me see. I just, I'm trying to think. What else would he go other than, like, the, the hammer free? I, make I mean, he could go beat stick, but I don't really have much healing, and I, I just bought the only healing item I have, which is Spear of Magus. So beast stick wouldn't make too much sense. It does have 50 power though, so even without them having healing immediately, it's still pretty good. Uh, he could go Crusher, but I would see the passive of that, so obviously it's not Crusher. So it has to be Yotun's, because he's spamming abilities like his life depends on it. Because, well, honestly, it kind of does. Alright, horrific down. There's the shell. Alright, massive kill. That kill gives me red buff. I uh, I kind of predicted him completely, and I got the horrific emblem too. You didn't see that three. <laughs> I don't actually think that he would have gone that far. Uh, oh, shit. I don't actually think he would have gone that far. Even if he full threed, because I did horrific him. I can go get my other... My upgraded starter item. I was going to say other cooldown item, but... I mean, it's tech. It's just another, or just an upgraded starter item. You go grab that. Uh, I want you to hit me. Do you have Crusher? No. Okay, so it's definitely Yotun's. Holy frick! My damage is nuts. 
Oh, my wave. Oh, man. Oh, I can just get this. I actually do a lot of damage. Um, I think I'm going to go get a Polynomicon, actually, instead of more cooldown. I'm going to go do some more damage to him. More burst. What's the gold difference? I'm about 3,500 up, so I should be about an item and a half up on him. Which makes sense, yeah. I don't know what the fourth item he's starting is yet, though. Like, at all. I am strong. Probably more defense, because I'm hitting him very hard. We'll see how much my two does here. Uh, That seems a little lower than it should be. But I have a hard time believing that he went double defense when I have a thousand damage ultimate. Hmm. So he definitely went more damage then, but he didn't finish the item. But he didn't finish the item. So let me think. He's got. He's got blue stone. All right. I, I guarantee these items. Blue stone. Soul leader. Genji's Yotins. He started a fifth item. He didn't finish it. He started a fifth item. What I'm assuming he started. Was more damage under the Yotins tree. So like a tier two Yotins maybe. Dude, it was literally perfect. It was literally, I guessed every single item. Every single item. This is a tier two under the Jotun's tree. Oh my God. I actually guessed every single item. Holy shit. All right. Well, there you go. That's exactly what you guys wanted. And uh, actually ended up being able to do it, which I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely surprised about. I really thought it would be a little bit harder, <laughs> but it turns out when people are spamming abilities on you that quick and sometimes they heal from abilities, it's pretty easy to tell, oh shit, they got, they got Ganges, Bluestone, Jotuns, and Soul Eater. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but... Uh, let me know what you guys thought of the, the video today and if it was entertaining i don't even know like i said it, it doesn't it seems like a weird request but i could see it being entertaining as like a different form of uh throwing off skill right but anyways anyways regardless thank you guys for watching if you did enjoy make sure to like comment and subscribe do not forget that uh every single like on the video is a addition to a charity pool that we're doing at the end of the year. And every single subscriber to the channel is an addition to a charity pool that we're doing at the end of the year. So make sure to do that. Until next time, guys. Peace.